So today, ladies and gentlemen, I have some highlights from a stream I did of 0.63's stress test offline single player mode, which is of course still very much work in progress and by no means complete. I will leave a link in the description to the official forum post of how to play this official single player mode and try out some of the new things like I do in this video. I try not to spoil too much, but I did have a lot of fun and I cannot wait to see Day's Eve fully realized in its new form. Remember to leave feedback and bugs on the feedback tracker for DayZ or the forums. I will leave links to both of these in the description below. Also, thank you for subscribing. Don't forget to hit that like button. Stick around. We're going to test some things out on this single player, official single player mode that is very much work in progress, guys. So don't take this as the final build. This is very much lacking in content. A lot of uh, things need adding, fixing and so on. This is just the stress test build uh, that's online uh, for a limited time. Uh, that we can mess about in a single player to try out things ourselves and try and survive the new infected and things like that. Which uh, are all still work in progress. This one's got a magazine already, so... If I drag the magazine off... Oh, I wanted to go first person. But if I put the magazine in there... Look at the animations! Uh, if I also... Take the magazine out, I believe. We can uh, <laughs> pull the slide back, that's awesome. That's our one round. Uh, to load ammo, we can also do that to combine. And load, I don't think I had enough inventory space. Put the magazine in my hands, the ammo on the floor. If I look at the ammo... Load that bullet in. So as you can see, the pistol's in three, which was in my hands. And we have to press 4 and hold it to load the magazine in. Performance so far, um, the online stress test that happened on Tuesday was amazing. Like, people was on about, like, double, triple FPS. This is supposed to be slightly worse than the online test. I didn't play the online test, so I couldn't tell you the difference personally for me. But it seems to be fine so far. Let me get my FPS counter up. You guys won't be able to see it, but I can see it and I'll tell you what it is. I'm currently at 60 FPS. We're running into... Electro now, we'll see how much it drops, but it is worse on the offline one, so we'll check. We'll keep an eye on it. Uh, FPS hasn't changed, still the same. There's going to be a whole generation of people that are going to get into the get this game, and I don't think it's fair that they won't have to deal with the same bullshit we had to do yet. <laughs> so now, if I put my pistol in there, put that in my hands, I can move while I drink. And the bar in the middle, the circle, fills up as I'm emptying the can. If I sprint, it stops. There we go. And we shred by that. Nope. So what we do is put our knife in. Look at it. Tear into rags by holding. And we get down with our knife. Get all dirty and in there. And then we got rags on the floor. So we can do that. And put more rags there. So C is up and down. You hold C will prone. Let me just check this out quick. <laughs> that is amazing. But um, FPS hasn't changed. We're just coming into Electro now and it's not budged for me. You can see the wind changes indoors and out. Gunshots are always uh, also different, so if we... Uh, Oh yeah. Uh, so we can't spam now. Literally everything disappears until you've had a sip and it takes one sip. It's not a, like a long animation, so... Which is great. Uh, performance, by the way, is still 60 FPS. Uh, my stream is 30, so you won't notice the 60 FPS, but it, it is still... Between 50 and 60. Yeah, it's... it's uh, double the FPS I get on 6.2. And this is worse FPS than what the online stress test gets, bearing in mind. And there is still more tweaking to do. We've been friends for far too long. Gonna unfriend you and start some Twitter drama. Oh, thank you, Lukic, man. I love a bit of Twitter drama. Thank you for the resub. Spam, there's a most for Lukic. Always supporting the stream, a true legend. The audio is, is good. This... I like the audio. That's a new door there. Isn't it? New enterable door load us this mag. Animations, though. It does need a nice click sound when them rounds slide in. 
Look. It's all in sync and shit. Oh my god, it's so good. Right, I got another drink, haven't I? Yeah, there's water. So let's have a little drink while we're walking still. So definitely a little bit of an echo, and we've got the creaking sounds in the warehouse. I do need food, though. Lou on the uh, stamina bar depleting. Definitely a bit too quick. Um, I mean, that's we've got a lot of weight on us now compared to when we started, but that's a that's the proper full-on sprint. I mean, you got to think that these guys... That's, that's not too bad, but I... IRL, I'm not the fittest guy in the world, but I could probably run further than that before I completely get knackered. But what you got to remember, this is an apocalypse tick survival situation. These guys probably are struggling for food and water, so they're not going to have the uh, energy that, that we would have. So, you know, we're well fed and all that. So we've got the energy to burn, to run. These guys, we're, you know, like now I'm struggling. I'm probably dying of starvation definitely now because it's red and things like that. So... Server performance, by the way, somebody did ask that earlier. Server performance on 6.2 is around 30 FPS. That is not tick rate. That is just server performance FPS. Uh, 6.3 server performance FPS is 3 to 400. Massive jump in server performance. Uh, it's uh, like I am impressed with this. There's still things to go as well. Obviously, like the camera clipping, like we can see stuff like this. Some stuff wants lining up a bit more, and you know, just fine tuning and tightening up. And uh, it's good to go for experimental, I think, other than the bugs that we don't know about in too, de too much detail and things like that. I don't think it'll be too far off experimental. Pretty cool how that actually affects it. Yes, there's a weight system. Everything should have a weight value. Uh, there we go. Uh, right hand side of uh, Pristine, it says under 0 0.25 kilograms. So the more weight, the heavier stuff I have, the lower this stamina bar here will be. So at the moment, it's just over halfway up the white. That's the full stamina bar. It's halfway up. The more I carry, the lower this will go. The heavier stuff I have. The less I have, the more stamina I'll have, the longer I can run. Oh god. Nearly foul. But good thing is if I do fall. Bam. I don't instantly die. Um emotes anyway, people were saying about. Let's see if we can F1 it. And we can move. While F1 in it, F2. Is our wave. I'm friendly. You can't move doing that one. F3. I love you. Is awesome. I'm new here, but I always loved Daisy, and I'm glad I always kept hope that it would eventually get better. Thank you, Booty from Hawaii. I really appreciate dropping the 100 bits and the support for Daisy. And welcome to the stream. Hope you enjoy your stay, and uh, and we can give you as much information as we possibly can. If somebody could put the uh, exclamation SP, single player, uh, link in there for anybody else at the moment who wants to try this. This is great, though. This is blowing my mind so far. And remember, guys, this is very much work in progress. This is not representative of the final product by any means. There's still many tweaks to be done, many content missing. FPS is blown my mind. I, di I didn't expect my FPS to be that increased. Keep it in mind, again... That the offline version I'm playing now is worse performance than the online stress test. Like, say for instance, um, 6-2, um, you pre have to press space to raise your weapon, right? Doesn't matter how long I've played, thousands of hours, many, many PvP experiences and encounters, I always panic and double press space and drop my weapon, like lower my weapon. In this, it's just like any other FPS game, your muscle memory's there, bang. 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 You know? That's right click. That's just hold right mouse. If you want to ADS at the moment, you can press middle mouse as well. So easy as that. Somebody in that window. Oh god, I missed. But at least I was quick. Hot bar responsiveness. Check this out. Bang. There's no animations linked to it yet, like putting the animate the weapon on your and off your back like there is in 6.2, but I'm sure those animations will come. I'm getting no apple spawning as well. Somebody said they found a dynamic apple. I'm getting no apples. Oh no, I take it back, there's an apple. Maybe Brian spawned that for me, I don't know. That is so much better, seeing the apples on the floor. So, oh, next level. 10 out of 10. Um. Ooh. Bloody hands.
I actually had sounds for the hand draw. I don't know if you guys heard that. Oh. Yeah, baby. Oh, no animation for cooking. Oh, I just shit myself or something. What was that noise? Oh, you know what is difficult, though? I am dying. Guys, I am dying right now. The real survival situation. No infected. Can you just eat and drink and not die? I don't know. Apparently Falcon can't. Oh, you want me to wash my hands, Laurie? Here we go. Clean hands, baby. I would not do this in the future once diseases have switched on. Always better to wash hands first. Definitely, Adam. Oh my god, I would be... I'm going to die so much, aren't I? So we got the turn animations as well. We can see... It's not the best, because we need to... Can't see it in too much detail with this camera so close, but... You can see his feet, look. He's doing proper movements. Like you would in real life. There's no sliding now. Even crouched. We can see... He's moving around. Legs are crossing. Oh, and by the way, guys... Let me just show you something. BAM! You can shoot yourself in the foot, that's so cool. Oh man, that's going to be so bad for so many people. If you go unarmed and raise your hands while lying down, you can kick- Oh, if you can kick- Okay, 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 I didn't- Okay, I misunderstood you. Right, let's do that. Um, raise hands, turn. <gasps> oh my god! Sixty FPS, no, no, uh, no issues at all. <laughs> we need more lag. Doesn't feel like Daisy anymore. It feels too smooth. No, that's actually. A, I'm quite happy to hear that. To be fair, uh, if I can find a well and not die, we'll try it. Look at this little jig I've got. Little sideways limp. Damn it, Adam! Spawn me one in quick. Oh, okay. There we go. <laughs> Oh my god, that was crazy. Yeah, I wouldn't mind blood on the clothes. I don't know if this is going to be high enough, you know, but we'll find out. God, that is so much better. Right, here we go. There we go. There's your fall animation. My health's dropping, so I am injured. Looks like I've got a, maybe a slight limp on me. But yeah, you'd be dead on 6-2. No doubts. You would be dead. Yeah, that was very high, Laurie. So you can no longer snap around. If you try and snap around, your character will stop with inertia. And you got to kind of get that going again. So you can zigzag still, but you're not so violently zigzagging where people go like that and they're nearly an impossible target to hit because they're so quick. Um, if, well, I pressed F11 earlier. Oh, I didn't have a gun in my hand, did I? Duh. Didn't have a weapon in my hand earlier. <laughs> oh, I love it. That never gets old. Never gets old. Anyway, I've got to get off because I've got to look after the wife, make sure everything's all right for bedtime, and I've got to be up early for the school run. Thank you for joining me today. It's been an adventure. It's been a journey. Didn't want to spoil too much for you, but we've seen some nice stuff. I'll probably make this into a video for YouTube for anybody who missed it or wants to go over it again and compare it to their experience and try out things that you may have seen.